Hi you guys, this is Carissa from With Our Best Blog and Earth Easy sent me this travel pack by Numinous. It's a London company and Earth Easy is a company that has camping gear, outdoor gear, gardening stuff. They're really awesome. I have really been enjoying browsing the items on their website. A lot of useful things on there so go check them out. So I'm going to be reviewing this Numinous backpack for you. This is the 65, as you can see down here. They make smaller ones, I think down to 25, and then larger ones up to 90. That's just about the size of it. That's how big it is. And this backpack is the ultimate backpack for security. I'm telling you, there are so many security features, it's amazing. They're definitely exceptional, probably the top of their class for travel backpacks for security. So let me tell you about the reasons why they're so secure. First of all, this fabric, it's anti-slash. And so they say for weight ratio, like compared to steel, it's stronger. So for how much it weighs to how much steel weighs or whatever. And so I guess you can't slash it. It definitely looks pretty cool. I don't know if you can see like the design on it, but it looks very, very strong and sturdy. They also have these TSA locks, one on the main zipper compartment and one on the smaller inside zipper compartment. You can see that one right there. Okay, so these TSA locks right here, you actually snap your zipper into them. And see, you can see it's like snapped in. And then you set your code and then it locks them into place. Then when you put your code back in, you can just go like that and it takes them out. So this is nice if you are like checking your bag, um, if you want it to be secure, but then TSA can still get into it because sometimes they need to check through your stuff if you're checking it on an airplane. So there's this little tiny spot for the TSA key and they can have access to it without compromising um, the security of your bag for everybody else. Okay, so they have two of the TSA locks. Then there's also this lock that's sort of hidden with this pocket over here, which is kind of nice because you don't want all these locks like being all showy like, oh, look, I have something in my bag. So, this lock is really cool. Like, I've never thought about this, but it's kind of nice if you're traveling by yourself or if you're going um, to a lot of places where you can't bring a bag or whatever, you can lock this to, like, a dorm bed or <clears throat> something that um, is sturdy on the ground that can't pull up, like a light pole or whatever. If you're staying in like a communal hotel, like a hostel in Europe, that's also nice too. Um, because sometimes like your stuff's just out there with a bunch of other people in your room. But just put this like either attach it to your locker or whatever. So you can just pull this out like this thing and then put it in this side and then lock it in and use your code and then it stays. So it actually gets really, really, really long and you can't see it, but it's a few feet long. So that's really nice. And so that lock, just attach your bag, and then they can't take it from the space. Like if you're in a re fancy restaurant or something, you need to leave it outside. Like you can keep an eye on it, but then you can also attach it so somebody can't just run off of it. Okay. What other security features are there? Oh, I should mention this. This is kind of a new up-and-coming thing. I don't know if you've seen that YouTube video that somebody put out about puncturing the zipper with just like a pencil or a knife or a pen or whatever. You can just puncture it and then just unzip the whole thing with just that item. Well, this is actually an anti-puncture zipper, so you cannot do that. I really like that you can zip up all the straps into here, and then you can just roll this up. This up. So it's nice to um, have it all zipped up and contained when you are in the process of traveling, for instance on the airplane, on a boat, whatever. So these straps aren't just hanging loose, getting dirty, um, getting stuck in things. You can carry it easily then with this strap on the side or this strap when it's all tucked in there. But when you want to use it as a backpack, these are the straps. You've got these bottom straps that hook onto your hips and they're very adjustable. They're also a little cushioned. You've got lumbar support. Look how cushiony this is down here. That's really, really nice. You also have really squishy, cushy 
These are comfortable. I've used backpacks in the past, and I'm really excited about this one. Um, it's breathable. It's highly adjustable. This actually, can you hear that Velcro? It can be adjusted up, down, um, so you can stick it on wherever. This also is adjustable at the top, so depending on how high you want your straps. And this is all really, really important, um, depending on the size that the person is, depending on the weight, depending on the shoulders, depending on your upper body strength. Um, when I've backpacked in the past, I've changed it up every couple of days too because your back gets tired in certain places. So that's really nice when it's highly adjustable and you can move it around. And so it's really exhausting when you have a backpack that's heavy the whole time and you can't get it right. So I'm excited about all the adjustable features on this. There's also like little loops you can hook things to with like carabiners. You can put a water bottle on here or keys or whatever. Um, there's hooks and things everywhere in this backpack. Okay, so next there's two pockets on the side. These are the mesh pockets. Obviously good for water bottles. Other things I like to put here are sunscreen, sunglasses, and then there's this inside pocket. Okay, so that's really deep. It goes all the way down the backpack. There's two mesh pockets. This is handy for like electronics, um, anything that you want. And there, this pocket right here. You can see, you can put sweatshirts, rain jackets, um, small blankets, pillows for the plane, whatever in here. These straps over here, there's two on this side and two on the other side. Kind of nice, you can stick something through this way. If you wanted to, again, put a jacket, you could also put like a yoga mat or you could put a sleeping pad, maybe even a, a really small sleeping bag, but just like this, and that's what you would do. And they're on both sides. And this strap, you can detach it. I don't really know why you would, but I don't know about just attached to that thing. This is for headphones or whatever cord you want to put in. This pocket is one of my favorite pockets. You barely notice it because it's right there. It sits on your back, like right where your butt is. And it's actually really secretive and hard to open. So in there you have some space. And that might be a good spot to put anything important because people wouldn't see it down there. Um, it would be a really sneaky spot for a passport or extra money or whatever important things you don't want to lose because that's not a spot that people are looking to take from. I mean, it's just, it's flat on your back right there and you don't, you wouldn't even know this. Um, one thing I didn't really know what this was for, I think it's like a rain shield. I think it just kind of like finishes the look of the backpack. But if you know what this actually is for, that would be nice to know. Um, it attaches here, and then attaches here on the side. And I just imagine once the backpack gets full, it just lays flat. So, but if there's another purpose, I'd love to know. <laughs> okay, so next, let me show you the inside of this backpack. It's amazing. So the backpack comes all the way in zip fully, which is super nice. I've had backpacks that do just the top comes out, and that's just the worst thing ever. I ended up using only half of my clothes as the top end of my bag because to get to all the bottom stuff was so obnoxious, and I was on the go the whole time. I've had the half zip, which is also nice, but to fully unzip your bag, you can half zip if you want. You can fully unzip. It's... It's absolutely what I recommend from using both of those ones, traveling. So, you can see this. Let me lift it up here. Look how huge this space is. That is like a typical carry-on duffel or uh, zipper bag for you. I mean, that is like a roller bag in a backpack. That's impressive. On this side, where like you're actually carrying it. You've got these mesh pockets, these ones, little pencil pockets, some zipper pockets, whatever. This is kind of nice. It's right here. So it's handy for like grabbing anything like maps or chapstick or whatever. So those are nice. This, I'm just so impressed with how large this capacity is. 
So overall, there are a lot of features, there are even some that I probably didn't talk about um, to this backpack. It's amazing. Once again, you can get it on Earth easy, and they've got lots of really cool stuff similar to this and other inventive items. So go check them out. Thanks for watching this review. Have a nice day.